Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. <laughs> it's open. Oh, hey, I've seen you around here. You're new, aren't you? Now, come on, I don't bite. Hard. <laughs> I'm kidding. Sit down. I don't think we really, uh, met as of recently. So what's your name? It's nice to meet you, sugar. Name's Angel. Angel Dust. Well, I mean, it is my favorite color. So I kind of just decorated my room the way I wanted to. Eh, don't touch that. That's, uh... <laughs> it's been used. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, welcome to my room. It's uh, nice and big. I didn't really think a hotel would have such spacious rooms, but uh, here we are. Yeah, there's a lot of things around this place. And luckily there's a... Uh, pretty good looking bartender down there too and he's well more than just a bartender he's uh he's actually a pretty decent guy just try not to get on his bad side because trust me I didn't want to get on that bad side because that kitty has claws meow <laughs> so how did you die since you're down here and everything Huh? You're not dead? No, what the fuck are you doing here? Oh, 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 yeah. I did hear something about Lucifer and Charlie talking about some human that got traveled or sent down here through like a portal or something. But that was you? <laughs> Man. To think I never would see an actual, you know, a live person down here without turning themselves into a, some random fucking demon or something. Well, I mean, it's, uh, it's good to see somebody at least. So, um, uh, before you, uh, you know, accidentally came down here, how's everything, you know, up there? Yeah, not good, huh? Kind of assume so. I mean, from what I get from the news and stuff that I see on my phone, and you know, there's a bunch of shit going on up there. Really? That's happening? Hmm. Never really thought that I would get rid of that app. I mean, it's so popular. Right? That's what I'm saying. I get all my information from that app. Anyway, besides that, I think, um, I think Charlie and, uh, Vaggy were talking about having another meeting set up with the Angels, like the last one got well, <laughs> but, you know, it's, it's to, you know, send you back home. Yeah, I overheard when I was taking a sip at the bar, they were talking to a few Angels, because, well, now that they're friends, it's easier to set up meetings and whatnot with them. So, what I heard is they're about to make a meeting, right? But, 
it's going to take a few weeks to get it, like, set up and whatnot. Hey, don't shoot the messenger. That's what I just heard. I mean, I'm not one to, you know, talk to angels and whatnot because those guys are fucking pricks. So, I just kind of stay to myself and uh, you know, just, you know, do what I do best. Well, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised you don't know what I do here. I mean, you've been down here for a few days now. I'm surprised my name hasn't gone all around this fucking hotel. Yeah, uh, hmm. Uh, how can I say this without, you know, freaking you out? Uh, hmm. I indulge in filmmaking. Yeah, you could say I'm an actor of some sort. A pretty fucking good one, too. Although my directors are... not the best. But I, I follow the scripts and I get paid for what I do. Eh, sometimes money, sometimes in other ways. <laughs> Mm-hmm. My movies can be seen everywhere on the internet. Oh, uh, uh, hmm. Well, I, mm, They're not really, like, uh, movie theater-based films. If you kind of get where I'm going... Bingo! That's what I do. Yeah, hence why I got so much makeup and stuff in here. It's all for a show and for recordings and all sorts of stuff. But since I live here now, my recordings and movie dates have been, uh, you know, kind of set back a little bit. Because, in all honesty, I just kind of just want to stop stop doing all this. It's getting kind of boring. I'm trying to better myself. And the only way to do that is do this hotel. <laughs> but, hey, I can't be a Debbie Downer all the time about all this stuff. I mean, I still have my friends around here to talk to. And, well, it's not all bad down here. Mm-hmm. Ah, trust me, you'll get used to everything here. I know I did. I wasn't really fond of this place at first. And, uh, well, I wasn't really the nicest of people who uh, walked out through those doors. And uh, I just wanted to escape. And the way I usually escaped through all that, uh, I guess you could say suffering, is I just went out and just drank and did a bunch of drugs and stuff. I'm not saying I still don't do that, I just don't do it as often anymore. Yeah. Mm, trust me, it's a lot better than, you know, doing what I was doing. Mm-hmm. In fact, I, uh... I grow quite fond of this place. I'm not even gonna lie about that. Some good people run in this hotel. There's some... Eh, interesting people as well. Like that strawberry pib. Oh, I don't think you've met him before. His name's Alistair. He's one s sweet piece of ass I could like to tap. <laughs> but he won't let me. Kind of a womp womp moment. <laughs> well, it just depends, honestly. Whatever you get yourself into, 
I'm pretty sure this hotel can, uh, you know, rehabilitate ya. Uh, oh, wait, you're not dead. I, I, I forgot about that. <laughs> so, um, uh, how, how exactly did you, you know? Uh-huh. Oh, no shit. So you just fell right through a portal and was in Lucifer's house? Well, I, I would say you're a lucky bastard for luck running into him, but also not really, because uh, I didn't, I don't know what Lucifer would do to you if they would have found out you just fell right through into his house. If I, if I was Lucifer at that moment, I honestly would have freaked out. Oh, he did. He did freak out. <laughs> you made him spit out his tea? Oh, that's fucking hilarious. <laughs> Tell me, how, how, how many rubber ducks was in his room? And be honest with me. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, that man has a weird obsession with those ducks. I don't really understand it myself. I'm more of a, you know, pig guy. That's why I got my little uh, pet pig right there. <coughs> yeah, I know, I know. I'll get you some food real quick. So, um, uh, if you, uh, don't really mind, I have to take care of my pet here. So, I'm gonna ask you to just, you know, skedaddle. No, no, you're fine. I just need to feed my pet, that's all. You can come back in at, like, a few minutes or something. Well, all right. Uh, door's right there. Don't let it smack in your ass while you're walking out. Or let me smack in your ass. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. See you in a few. <laughs>